Severe weather threats continue tonight along the Louisiana coast. Channel 5 Cecilia Gutierrez spoke with one group from the valley braving the force of Barry. It's a familiar call for Cajun Navy South Texas Director Todd Breland. The call to help others during a natural disaster, even Barry poses its challenges. This, is, this has been the craziest thing I have ever seen in my life. Armed with flat bottom boats and a steady supply of food, the Valley Group took to Louisiana, the birthplace of the Cajun Navy, to ferry people to safety and face Barry head on. But there's no flooding here in Lafayette. I'm in Lafayette right now. And now to the south, to the to the Gulf, of course, there were some hit areas, but it pounded the very bottom of the state for two days. Breland says they have one job to help the smaller communities in Louisiana, like Covington, perform high water rescues. He says the past two days weren't that busy, but Barry's rain band started to fire up this morning. And there's warnings in two areas there now. Well, Baton Rouge and North Baton Rouge, to, you know, and all of Southeast Louisiana has got more rain today and more uh, more hurricane weather than the three previous days combined. He says everywhere you look, there are boats lined up at the ready. My home state of Louisiana, I think, has been more prepared for Barry than any storm in history. Cajun Navy South Texas aren't the only ones who answered the call. Cajun Navy groups from all over the Gulf Coast did as well. Breland says he learned a lesson this time. Mother Nature is truly unpredictable and works on its own time. In Mercedes, Cecilia Gutierrez, Channel 5 News, this weekend.